Armour was awake, excitement in her homes. I felt the ground shake, anticipation in my bones. Croke Park beckoned for the Blue and White Legion, champions of Waterford, this magical region. It began in reflection last September. Then came redemption and a year to remember. We marched through the county with many a test, emerging victorious, Waterford's best. Pride restored, we set our eyes on Munster. Power and strength, all we could muster. We charged on Limerick from the sunny southeast, our herders on the trick and other hurling feasts. Hurling talent, a gift from the skies. Flavin and Keating's gardens, we watched our young players rise. Next was Bedyke and Carrigonor, another step closer to hurling folklore. We swarmed on Mallow like an Atlantic storm, and just like that, legends were born. Down to 12 men, the miracle of Mallow, but these men are giants, impossible to follow. Hennessy's, O'Donnell's, Pendergast, monster title medals, glory at last. Holmstone's, monasteries, hurling mastery, another chapter in our glorious tapestry. The village was hopping as we racked up the winds, points in the tower, debates in Quinns. An All-Ireland semi-final against the men from Donegal, another victory, a four-goal haul. The primary schools were buzzing, children screaming, tactics on the street corner, old men dreaming. St. Declan looked down, a smile serene, oh my god, he said, what a team. We thought of those who passed, went on ahead, they whispered kindly, keep the head. We had a chance, a shot at national glory, for a club like ours, an incredible story. The carrot fields were empty, the nets were taken in. Dublin came calling, the journey began. Hurling in our hearts, fire in the blood, the rain was coming, we prepared for the flood. Storm clouds gathered in the darkening skies, starling murmuration, seagull cries. With the strength of Samson and the might of the tower, the storm was raging in all its power. The army was ready, we all had the fever. Our leaders were steady, Putin and Vladimir Wheeler. We went knocking, we broke down the door, and the place was rocking with the armor roar.